In the heart of a dense forest, an abandoned house stood, its decaying walls and broken windows telling tales of forgotten memories. The moon cast an eerie glow upon the desolate structure, as if warning all creatures to stay away. But on this particular night, a curious raccoon ventured into the darkness, unaware of the horrors that awaited it. As the raccoon cautiously entered the house, its tiny paws echoed through the empty halls. The air was heavy with the scent of decay, and the silence was broken only by the sound of its own heartbeat. Little did the raccoon know, it was not alone. Its sharp claws scraped against the ground, leaving behind a trail of dread. The raccoon's senses heightened, sensing danger, and it scurried deeper into the house, seeking refuge. The raccoon found itself at a crossroads, torn between the upstairs and the basement. The stairs creaked ominously as it ascended, leading it to a room filled with dusty furniture and forgotten memories. The raccoon's heart pounded in its chest as it hid, beneath a moth-eaten armchair, hoping to remain unseen. Its glowing eyes pierced through the darkness, searching for its prey. The raccoon trembled, feeling the weight of the dinosaur's presence, just beyond the walls. Time seemed to stand still as the raccoon contemplated its next move. The basement beckoned, promising safety in its depths. With a final surge of courage, the raccoon scurried down the stairs, its tiny paws echoing through the empty space. The basement was a labyrinth of shadows, its corners shrouded in darkness. The raccoon huddled in a corner, its heart pounding in its chest. The air grew thick with tension as the theopod dinosaur prowled above, its heavy footsteps causing the floorboards to groan. <coughs> Minutes turned into hours as the raccoon remained hidden, its fear consuming every fiber of its being. The house seemed to come alive with the whispers of forgotten souls, their presence haunting the raccoon's every thought. Finally, as dawn broke and the first rays of sunlight pierced through the broken windows, the theopod dinosaur retreated into the depths of the forest. The raccoon cautiously emerged from its hiding place, its body trembling with exhaustion and relief. As it made its way back into the forest, the raccoon couldn't help but glance back at the abandoned house. It knew that it had narrowly escaped a fate worse than death. The forest seemed to sigh in relief, as if acknowledging the raccoon's bravery in the face of unimaginable terror. From that day forward, the raccoon never ventured near the abandoned house again. It had learned the true meaning of fear, and the horrors that lurked in the shadows. And as it continued its journey through the forest, it carried with it a newfound respect for the unknown, forever changed by its encounter with the theopod dinosaur.